This is Math 142, practice test number two, problem number 12, and we are going to get on this thing. So um, we are going to find the tangent, the exact value of the tangent of uh, 13 pi over 2. And we were even told how to break it up right here. So we'll break it up using that, that tangent subtraction uh, relationship that we know. So we know it is um, tangent of the first value same operator, that's minus, so same operator, and then tangent of the second value, all over one, now it's opposite operator, so now it's plus. Um, tangent of the first value times tangent of the second value. So just basically those two tangent values multiplied together. All right, so let's figure out what those tangent values are. Uh, three pi over four is here. Its tangent is negative 1, so it's been divided by a negative version of itself. Uh, 11 pi over 6 is here. Its tangent value is a little more work. Uh, negative 1 half over root 3 over 2, y over x. Boy, that is an ugly looking 3. Let's see if we can't do something with that. There we go. The 1 halves divide out, so I end up with negative 1 over root 3, which is the same as negative root 3 over 3. So I'm going to plug these in and see where they go. So tangent 11 pi over 6 is negative root 3 over 3. So that's going to go here minus tangent of that is negative 1 all over 1 plus opposite operator. Uh, the first tangent multiplied by the second tangent. So notice what I have here then is uh, negative root 3 over 3 plus 1 over 1 plus a negative times a negative is positive, root 3 over 3. And that's the right value, but it's not in the right form. I'm going to have to manipulate this form a little bit. So let's see what I can do. Um, I'm going to change. I, I can add these fractions together. So I'm going to think of this as 3 thirds. I think of that as 3 thirds. So up top here, I have negative root 3 plus 3 over 3. And in the bottom, I have uh, 3 plus root 3 over 3. And I'm just going to change the order of these. I'm going to rewrite this as uh, 3 minus root 3 divided by 3 over 3 plus root 3 divided by 3. The thirds divide out. So I have 3 minus root 3 over 3 plus root 3. All right, I still have a problem. I cannot leave those radicals in the denominator. So I need to get this root 3 out of here. And the way I'm going to do that is multiply by the uh, conjugate of that. So 3 minus root 3. And I'm actually multiplying by 1, not changing the value of this, just changing the form. Uh, this times this, this is 9. Um, root 3 times negative root 3 is negative 3. 9 minus 3. Notice the middle term drops out. 3 root 3, negative 3 root 3, which we want to happen. Up here I got 9. Uh, negative root 3 times negative root 3. A negative times a negative is positive. Root 3 times root 3 is 3. And then notice I have a, three, a negative 3 root 3 and another negative 3 root 3. So minus 6 root 3. So I'm going to keep going from there. 9 plus 3 is 12. 12 minus 6 root 3. And that's over 6. Both of these are divided by 6. So that's 2 minus root 3. Whew, that's a lot of work. 